I think uh, there are two issues. One is that uh, the, the president uh, sworn uh, in today will have to manage the incoming president so that uh, that's a show of number one confirming the alliance. Uh, and, uh, but the, uh, the details and the substance like thought and others will probably be delayed because of the, uh, the serving in process which needs to proceed very quickly. Um, concerning uh, North Korea, we have a new president and it's been a quite uh, tension-ridden relation for the past five years uh, or you could argue nine years of the relationship. So uh, the new president has stated that he'd like to probably uh, have a new relationship. So that's a, uh, a show of a very strong sign coming mm -hmm. from the president. Mm -hmm. But for him to say that he is willing to fly out north to North Korea, right. is that going to somehow upset the U.S. president? Yeah, um, there's a difference, a fine line between uh, meeting uh, the North Korean president anywhere, anytime, which needs to be negotiated because place uh, and where you meet is highly symbolic. So I, I don't think it will create, uh, it's a rhetoric, it's an invitation. So I think when the actual details of the meeting place has to be negotiated down. But you're right that it could cause a bit of uncertainty. But I, I don't think it, it should be a, a problem because it's not been uh, hammered down as to the exact place. And, and the time as of yet. And uh, the bad anti-missile defense system somehow played a part in this uh, South Korean presidential election. Uh, and he was saying, he's saying in the ceremony that in order for him to solve this issue, he's going to negotiate. He used the word negotiate with China and the U.S. Right. So does that mean that he wants to sort of somehow go back on this agreement with the U.S.? Um, I think uh, there, there are two issues. Number one is uh, that uh, he doesn't have a government in formation yet. It'll take at least a month with a ruling minority party. Uh, he's appointed uh, prime minister elect and the head of President Apparatus, head of the intelligence service, but that'll take some time. So I think uh, his rhetoric aside uh, is a strong demonstration that uh, number one, confirming the alliance. But the details has to be worked out uh, from now on until the uh, uh, parliamentary elections next year. So rhetoric strong, but I think uh, uh, there's not a detailed message about exactly which thought will be 